welcome to Not My Studio. <laughs> Today we are in the car and we're travelling in regional Victoria um, when the lockdown restrictions weren't too tough um, to visit some family and we thought during the drive I'd have a go at painting in the car. For this piece I'm using my Edge Pro Gear easel. I'm actually using it upside down. This is actually my second attempt in this car trip of painting in the car and this ends up being the one that works better. I have my new tube of Gamblin Equality Orange which came out recently in support of the Black Lives Matter movement and I couldn't think of anyone better to try out this new colour than one of my recent Instagram faves, Baby Sammy. She is a one-year-old baby from Alice Springs whose mum Pat posts some amazing photos of her just smiling and being the most gorgeous bub ever. This photo here went a bit viral here in Australia for the power pose and just the amazing spirit that this kid has is just the best thing. She puts such a smile on my face and I think at this point in time we just we need a smile so I really wanted to have a go at painting little Sammy and doing her some justice so yeah I'm, I'm gonna have a go on this little ampersand gesso board just with my oils and I've got a little bit of liquid in the little jar lid there um, which I use minimally and a scrap of denim to use as a drop cloth so let's see how I go.
all pretty blocked in and I'm working out the face, I just wanted to say a little bit about backgrounds. I've always struggled with backgrounds because I don't want to draw every leaf on a tree and exact details of what's going on behind the face because I want the audience to look at the face. I want the portrait to be the hero of the image. But recently I've been ex experimenting with these choppy backgrounds that have multiple colours sort of working their way into the hair and unifying with the portrait and sort of adding different chunks and trying not to be too fussy with the brush strokes. I'm not sure what's working and what's not, but I'm having fun experimenting. And I think that's part of it, is to constantly challenge yourself to try things in different ways, especially if you don't feel like you've found a groove that you're really happy with. Uh, let me know in the comments what you like to do with backgrounds, because yeah, I'd really like some feedback on what other people like to do and what you find interesting in a way to complete the image around a portrait. Along that same issue of background, here in the t-shirt I decided to avoid the big Adidas logo and instead play with leaving some of the white of the surface there. This is a different background idea entirely, but I don't know, I kind of like having both in the same piece. It's sort of interesting, so not sure what I like better. is always my favourite bit, adding those details to just get the expression right there. Okay, I went slightly over time, but I think you'll agree it was worth it. There she is. I'd just like to say a huge thank you to Sammy's mum, Kaya, who gave me permission to make some fan art and share it all with you. Um, I'd also like to say so I sent the painting up to Sammy, so I hope she likes it. Um, and it's a fun little memento of, yeah, this, this cool time as she becomes Instagram famous for just being her, the bright little sunshine that we need in the world. Thanks again for watching. Hit subscribe if you'd like to see more of my work. I'm working on a big painting in the background at the moment, so a few more quick studies before I can show you more of that. And yeah, new video next week. See ya.